As of last night, I was enjoying a relaxing vacation in Santorini when around 6 p.m. I received a phone call from Pam, literally less than 12 hours before the wedding, to let me know as a father of the bride, I'm supposed to write a speech. <laughs> Today as I watch her marry the man of her dreams, I'm filled with pride and joy. Pam and Frank are about to embark on a wonderful journey filled with love and happiness. Can you, without messing it up, pull it through and finish the tie? Who knows? Chris, watch how I fix it, Chris. Watch this. Watch the dad. This is old man skills. For me, I would say, you've been always looked and have been this beautiful from the minute you were born. May the two of you treat each other with love, compassion, and most importantly, respect. My dear friends, you have come together in this cathedral church so that the Lord may seal and strengthen your love so that you may assume the duties of marriage in mutual and lasting faithfulness. May the Lord bless these rings, which you will give to each other as a sign of your love and faithfulness. It's a dream come true. You know, didn't expect to meet you the way we did. But from the moment we met, you made me the best person I can be. Did he know we were doing this? No. That's no. good. No. Okay. <laughs> there's, there's honestly no other place I'd rather be right now. I love you. I can't wait to spend every day with you and raise a family with you um, and grow old together with you because you're my best friend. And I love you. <laughs> you may kiss. Oh.
now I ask all of you to please raise your glasses to toast Pam and Frank, wishing them all the best for a long and happy life together.